DeKalb County police say a mother is now under arrest for the death of her baby girl. Investigators say she died in a hot car while her mother was inside at a hair appointment. They say this happened last month. 11 Lies Faith Abube joins us now with more. Yeah, but that's not what the 25-year-old mom told police. Instead, officers spent the last four weeks piecing together what they believe actually happened to 13-month-old Skyler. Officers were called to the Emory University Hospital parking deck the afternoon of June 15th. Well, they say the call came in as a woman in medical distress having a seizure. First responders found Fowler at the scene and started treating her and found the child in the back seat unresponsive. Officers say the child had actually been dead longer than that. They say around 10 o'clock that morning. Video shows Fowler going into a salon at the North Lake Festival shopping plaza in Tucker. She was getting her hair done and didn't come back out of that salon until about 4 p.m. Police say she had left the car running, but it went off and the child was in there and was already dead by the time she came out. Instead of calling police, police say that she asked someone to help her jumpstart her car and then Googled signs of seizures, texted the child's godfather saying she was going to urgent care for headaches and drove to Emory University Hospital, which is where she called 911 from the parking deck. Police say Fowler tried to cover the child's body with clothes so the person who helped jumpstart her car wouldn't notice. That's part of the reason why she was charged with murder in the second degree, cruelty to children in the second degree, and concealing a death. I don't believe it was intentional. Uh, it seems to be like it seems that it was it was an accident. Um, however, you know, with that in mind, there's consequences that come with that. Well, Skyler has been buried. Her body was taken back to South Carolina, where her family is from. Uh, police say the mother had only been here in the area for a few months when Skyler died. She's in jail tonight without bond.